Well, hello there, guys. Welcome back to my channel. It has been a minute since we have done a favorites video. It's been too long. Don't know why. I kind of just like go through phases where I use the same products over and over and over, and then I'm just like, okay, I have new things to show you. First and foremost, let's <laughs> first and foremost, let's address the elephant in the room, Alex. There's nothing on your face. I'm not wearing any foundation or makeup really. I just threw on a little bit of mascara and that's about it because it is literally like 99 degrees out and it's humid and I had so many errands to do today and I was just like, I can't do this because my foundation has been melting off lately. If you have any tips and tricks to help that foundation stay on through the heat, I used to be able to do it and now I just can't. <laughs> Let me know, send me a tweet or something. My social medias are below. So June is over, it's July now, <laughs> it's so weird. This year is flying by. Um, I have a lot of favorites to hop into. We have some beauty, we have some clothing, we have some athletic stuff, uh, and I'm really excited to share. Um, I don't even know what to start with. Let's start with beauty. Beauty is always really fun, so let's hop on into it. Okay, so let's first talk about some skincare. So if you guys have been watching me for a while now, you know that my skin has been through quite a journey. Um, I'm on my fourth month of Accutane and whew, it's been a journey, man. Uh, I've done a couple videos on it. I am gonna do a finishing up video after my six months is over. Um, but essentially, I have been trying to fade my acne scars and they are getting there slowly but surely. And I do think that this product has really helped. Um, you guys were all tweeting this to me. The Taylor, I think is her username. She also has been on Agutane and she recommended this. And you guys were all like, try this, she recommends it. So I'm like, yes, I will try it. It's from The Ordinary, it's the organic cold pressed rose hip seed oil. Um, I'm probably about a quarter of the way through. This stuff is definitely potent. <laughs> it has a very, like, honestly, it doesn't absorb very well. I feel like it stays very wet. So I have to put it on right before bed and kind of just like, lay upward or I put it on like right after I wash my face so I can stand for a few hours before I like toss and turn in bed but I feel like it's helped so much and I've heard amazing things about rosehip oil like it's organic it's good I'll link what I can below uh, it's also good for like anti-aging and hydration and stuff and it's safe for sensitive skin and Accutane skin so um, I'm really liking that so far I also use vitamin C serum but I have a whole video on my skincare, so I'll be quiet. Lips, my lips have been so dry, so dry. I can never say <laughs> the name. It is a Korean skin brand. You guys always tell me how to pronounce it and I still don't know. So I'm not even gonna try to say it, or should I? <laughs> Lineage, hmm? This is the Sleeping Lip Mask. Um, you guys can see how much I have used of it. It's literally like, maybe halfway gone. So this is like an overnight lip mask. This stuff is amazing. It's kind of like rose. It smells really nice. It feels super good on the lips. When you put it on, it gives like a very glossy sheen. Like I have been wearing this during the day. It's great overnight, but it also looks really pretty during the day. And honestly, since it's a mask, it stays on so much better. I feel like all my other chapsticks kind of just absorb into my lips and they're gone after like 30 minutes. This will stay on for hours if you don't like eat it off or whatever. I highly recommend this if you have dry lips and it also gives like that pretty pink kind of tint to your lips. This stuff is literally magic. Now that summer is here, I've been using this way more. This is the Mario Badescu Facial Spray with Aloe, Cucumber, and Green Tea. This has been very soothing on my skin since I have that sensitive um, Accutane stuff going on. If you have dry skin or even if you get hot throughout the day, if you just want something refreshing, this refreshes makeup so nicely. Like if you're getting hot, just spritz a little bit on. I believe they sell it in smaller sizes as well. I know everyone is obsessed with the rose one as well. Mario Badescu products are definitely popping. I have tried so many of them and I highly recommend them personally. Literally have bought like everything from Mario Badescu. I also use um, the grapefruit cleansing lotion. Um, I have a lot of products that are in like my day-to-day -day routine. So this is great for just on the skin, refreshing makeup, staying cool in the summer soothing. That would honestly also be really great if you got like a sunburn on your face because of the aloe in it. Then we have from It Cosmetics. This has been my go-to moisturizer lately. It's their Bye Bye Redness for redness and sensitive skin. So it's green. So as you can see, it's a very like 
light tint of green. It's not like really, really intense. It's just a little bit. So when I put it on all over, I definitely feel like it neutralizes my redness a little bit, but it's not like anything crazy. It's great on a day where you don't want to wear a lot of makeup, even just going barefaced. You tone it down, you get that moisture, and um, it's just, it feels really good. It doesn't feel like greasy and heavy. Another side effect of Accutane is cracked, dry skin. So the Aveda Hand Relief Cream has been um, such a game changer. This stuff is awesome. So it has like all these great ingredients in it that just really, really hydrate. I've been using this every night before bed. I lather it on and go to sleep and I wake up and my hands feel like super amazing. Um, I've been using Aveda Lip Saver Chapstick. I've been using the Damage Remedy Shampoo and Conditioner, which I used a long time ago. The products are really good. I forgot how much I love Aveda. So if you're looking for like a new hair care or skincare system, I highly recommend them as well. Oh my god, I'm also obsessed with this toner too. Um, as I said, I've been using the Mario Badescu Cleansing Lotion kind of as like a toner, but I just got sent this random box of PR. I just spit everywhere. I don't know if you saw it. From rude cosmetics so it's a korean like skincare and beauty line this is just what the toner looks like so i want to say i've been using this now for about a week I feel like it's cleared up a couple breakouts that i had really quickly i also just feel like my skin feels really soft smooth hydrated i don't know why some toners feel better than others like it doesn't make your skin feel all like tight and dry this stuff is really really good it's got um <laughs> aha bha and nmf you tell me what that means. All I know is it feels really good. Um, it's for skin trouble, cleaning your pores, and for moisture. So it kind of just does everything in one, and it is safe for sensitive skin, but it just it's felt really nice on my skin. I have a couple makeup favorites. This I have talked about in my Insta stories and get ready with me's. I have never understood the power of this powder. This is the Bare Minerals Original Face Powder. So I don't understand it. I really don't understand the magic of it. Bare Minerals somehow got me on their PR list. Thank you, Bare Minerals. They sent me like a whole thing of all of their colors of original powder and the mineral veils. And I was like, wow, that's crazy. So I'm just gonna try it. And like, it covers everything. It is shocking. If it wasn't so hot, I would put some on, but like, Trying to put this on sweaty skin is a no-no. I swirl it on with the Beautiful Finish brush. I use this every single day. Like, it gives you the most stunning, natural, radiant skin finish, but it covers everything. And I don't understand because it's a powder. There's something magical in here. I use the shade Fairly Medium 05, um, and this is like a good, like, tan summer shade for me. They do have a very nice shade selection. And they also came out with veils like to set it that are like illuminating hydrating um more tan than the original so they've kind of expanded since i tried this because i loved this i want to say like 10 years ago maybe when i was like 15 or 16 so it's kind of crazy that it's like come back into my life again this was the first foundation i ever tried i remember my mom took me to bare minerals and i was like let's just go for it and they took me through like all the steps like blush, bronzer, everything, and I was like, my skin is flawless. How does this happen? This stuff is such full coverage. I don't even need under eye concealer. Like, I don't need it. It's crazy. So if you're looking for, like, a new foundation that's very, very natural looking, but beautiful, like, full coverage, you can layer it on. It's stunning. Like, I can't rave about it enough. So I have a couple of jewelry favorites. I'm so corny. I got this little ring online. Instagram knows me too well, so the top says Alex and the bottom says Alan. I get recommended <laughs> way too much stuff that I genuinely want on Instagram and Facebook. They, like, know me. I'm like, the government, I don't know what are you doing, but <laughs> you guys know what I want. So of course I'm like, that's cute, and it's rose gold. It'll match my engagement ring. Ooh, I need one. So... <laughs> I bought it. It just looks so cute, our names together. <laughs> so if you're as extra as me, or maybe you want one for like you and your mom or your bestie, it's pretty cute. I don't remember the site. I'll find it and I'll link it below. So I'm also wearing one of my favorite necklaces. Actually, I'm wearing two of my favorite necklaces. Um, so I've been buying from Miranda Fry for a very long time. I uh, found them through Alexandria Garza's channel, and I'm always looking for like good quality jewelry. So I've literally been buying from there for probably about six months. Um, I have necklaces, earrings, a ring. I have a bunch of stuff. I have accumulated quite a bit. So I was super excited when they like saw me tagging them and stuff all the time uh, and noticed me like buying their stuff. And they were like, hey, do you want a coupon code for your viewers? And I really appreciate that. So I just wanted to throw that out there. If you guys want 10% off their website, um, they gave me a code called fearless. 
and they wanted to do a little giveaway for you guys so very exciting this is not sponsored it's just something nice um so this is my favorite necklace from them i bought this maybe three or four months ago and it's just so pretty so this is the little peace charm it's a little dove really cute so you guys can um win this necklace and pick your own charm they do have other charms amazing quality you know i have very sensitive skin so if you are worried about that you're good to go on these super super high quality if you guys want to win a necklace from miranda fry you guys can just head over to my instagram i'm going to post a photo on there to make it like easy and you could just do it all through instagram i also recently got these super cute hoops from miranda fry as well these are their medium hoops and they have these cute little crosses on them. I really like Miranda Fry because they have charms and you can kind of like buy different charms and like mix and match. Okay guys, I found the best sports bra ever. The best sports bra. Oh my god. Hallelujah. <laughs> it looks a little odd. It's um, it's one of those ones that claps, claps? <laughs> Clasps in the front like this. So this is amazing. It also zips and it has a little secure little doop de doop like that um so it will completely stay in place that zipper doesn't fall down this is magical so um this is from curvy couture intimates and i remember i met them way back when i went to the first curvy con um i met summer shout out to summer if you're watching and i tried some of their bras and fell in love they sent me some sports bras this was my favorite one they sent me a few different styles but this is my favorite one i like that it clasps in the front so you don't have to worry about straps falling down i am wearing a 42c i did size up I always size up in band on sports bras. I'm usually a 40C in regular bras. They have a really nice size selection. I like it because it is padded. It gives you like a little support and lift, um, but more than just like a regular sports bra, you know, with no padding. So I love this. They have different colors. It's amazing. I'll find this one and link it below for you. It's really good. I also got new gym sneakers. If you didn't know, I've been doing personal training now for like almost three months and I'm totally obsessed with it. <laughs> like it's helped me so much with my anxiety, my mental health, my physical health. I just feel really good. So I found some new sneakers because I am in the gym like three times a week. So these are the Adidas Cloud Foams. These are so good. I asked you guys on Twitter, you recommended these. So Thank you. So like I said, Adidas cloud foams. As you can see, they're just like really thick on the bottom. They're like walking on a cloud. <laughs> and I actually get compliments on them all the time because they're pretty cute too. So they have different colors, all that jazz. They run pretty true to size. So yeah, I'm really a big fan. And one last pair of shoes. I just got these at Target last week and I'm obsessed so I had to just throw them in here. Look how cute these are. So they're kind of like straw looking kind of <laughs> and then they have little tassels here i've been looking for like a pair of these tassely fringy looking shoes and i just found these at target and totally fell in love with them so these are actually pretty wide too they're not wide fit but they fit my wide foot even my mom tried them on and she was like these are actually pretty wide so if you have wide feet um these fit me so they probably will fit you too uh, yeah, I'll find them. Hopefully they're on the Target website. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'll link what I can below. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up, please and thank you, and subscribe. Turn on your bell because so many people have been telling me they're not getting notifications at all and you have to like turn them off and turn them back on. I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> okay, anyway, have a beautiful day. I love you so much and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.